So I'm Northern Lion, I'm back here playing FTL on the Kestrel ship. What is our goal here? Well, you know, while well, we're taking a quick break here, let's uh, send people who need some healing over to the med bay. Seems like a smart idea to me. We're gonna have to take two trips anyway. Might as well just get everybody decked out here, and then we'll hit that button, and then uh, we got Lauren needs a little bit of healing, and Banks needs a little bit of healing. Well, um, our goal is to win, obviously. It's pretty important uh, whenever that can happen, but secondarily, Getting two more uh, species, two more alien species on board our ship wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. As for like tertiary goals right now, what else do we need? Offer your services. Yes! No, you need a beam or a teleporter for that. Uh, a special beam, I should say. Um, one of these days I'll get that quest. I get teleporters more often now. You would expect that I would. All right, reject their offer. This has been pretty awful so far. Uh, we will be able to sell a hull beam in here, I think, because I don't want to keep that. And what do we have here? Cloaking, hack it. Well, first let's sell. We can't buy anybody, so that's okay. We'll sell our hull beam for 35. That takes us up to 154. I mean, here's the thing. It seems really smart to buy cloaking. That gives us some missile defense. I know that that will also take all of the scrap that we have, and we've been trying to upgrade some stuff for a while, but being able to actually dodge missiles seems very, very fucking important. So I'm gonna buy that, even though it costs us. Now we need to get another bar of reactor power. We can take one away from the engines right now to power up to level 1 cloaking. Um, and they don't have missiles, but we can dodge their ions at least, so just be, be smart about this. They're gonna board us in this room, which is very stupid of them. So be it though, we'll vent the oxygen out of these rooms quickly. That slug is not gonna help them out too much here. So we're just gonna hit them where it hurts with the uh, ion, and then... I'm gonna see if I can maybe take out their weapons quickly. Um, there we go. Just before they shoot us with the ion, which they, they probably will do like right now. They're only gonna shoot one ion at us. I actually don't want to use cloak to get out of the way of one ion. I think that's kind of a waste. So we'll just hang tight until um, they get another chance to shoot, if they get another chance to shoot, which is a little suspect. Um, we can take another shot here. Yeah, let's do it. We'll, we'll take a quick shot at their... Uh, I was thinking med bay, but I guess we'll just take weapons. Ah, we killed one of the mantises in the in the process there as he was on his way to the med bay. Oh, uh, we actually can theoretically take damage on this fight. It's just not very likely. Banks, why don't you hang back here for a second and we'll depower engines even more because our dodge chance isn't super important. And we'll just get you healed up in the med bay. You're really going to send an NG to fight me? Like, why do you hate your NG is basically what I'm trying to get at here. We'll just go attack their shields a little bit. And their laser's about to come in, so we'll just cloak briefly. That'll also stop them from taking their NG back. We're, oh, uh, actually, it won't because we're going to decloak pretty soon because of our auto-firing ion blast. Um, everybody back to base, though. I said everybody back to base! There we go. And uh, we'll attack their med bay quickly. That's going to fuck with their NG. Uh, and we might be able to kill them all. Theoretically. We'll see if this can actually work out in our... Ah, uh, no. Where did that slug come from? I got confused. There we go. That NG is again nearly dead, but they fix up so quickly. It's hard to keep track. Wait for a second. Uh, their shields are completely down. I want to hit this NG again. I mean, one of these days that he is going to succumb. And you know what? We're just going to accept uh, their surrender. They fired another ion at us. Seemed very much like that was after the whistle there, but that's okay. Because we're fine. We are going to power up a little bit more on our reactor power just so we can... Afford to get that full level dodge chance, takes us up to 25, plus cloaking, pretty useful. Need to get that third bar of shields. Kate always tells me before the end of Sector 5, third bar of shields, choose your doom. I'm gonna choose Slug. I'm choosing Slug because maybe they'll surrender a crew member to us. So we'll wait until some of their shots come in here. We should be able to fight them pretty effectively. So they're not gonna shoot an ion at us right off the bat, we'll wait till they shoot maybe those lasers at us, which should be like... Now, and we waited until that other shot came in, so then we dodge quickly. I'm surprised all those shots missed. You wouldn't expect that. Um, uh, just wait a second here. Okay, one last ion blast. Come on, you can do it. It missed, so we're going to go on weapons quickly with the burst laser, because we have to. Started a fire. That's good news. They have uh, still enough lasers to get through our shields for sure, but keep this uh, ion blast firing here. This is the scary part. Okay, we managed to actually dodge that, much to my surprise. One more Ion Blast landing on the shields is good here. And then we can hit the weapons again, hopefully. Three misses, huh? Alright. Fuck me, I guess. Turned off auto fire, just so we can dodge all of these laser shots. So we can just, you know, augment their shots so that they can't 
shoot us all at the same time, or they can't shoot all their weapons at the same time, that's wonderful for us, because that's the main way that they're going to get through shields. Are you seeing this incredible fucking dodge chance? Like, does Burst Laser have an automatic penalty to dodge, or to, to hitting or something? Okay, we at least hit them twice on the weapons there. They did not even make it through our shields that time. I mean, they're getting shit luck as well. We should be able to kill one of the slugs here. And okay, we did. We did. And now they only have like a two laser shot coming out, which is good. And we can actually cloak out of that one just to lower the chance that they could even do anything. And then we'll like come out of our shield or our cloak here and we'll hit this slug where it hurts. And he's in a bad place too. Now they only have an ion weapon working. I mean, here's the thing. I want to get them to surrender. There are easier ways to kill them. We could fire on like the oxygen room, for example. But killing their crew seems to be a really good way to inspire terror, as you can see. They've got to send in another person to repair this now. We can micro our, um... We can micro our, uh... Ion weapon a little bit more if we wanted to. There we go. Take their piloting system out so we're unlikely to miss from now on. Um... Yeah, we can micro our Ion a little bit more, but it's not that important. They they should surrender, like, right now, or they're gonna possibly, uh, lose. Well, we missed one. Still. Um... They're screwed. Our shields are so down, but they can't fire anything in return, so... Whatever, I suppose. Might as well cloak, get that ion shot dodged. We're just really hoping we get a crew member, but no such luck. 21 scrap and an extra 50. That is crazy town. So there's a store there, but we don't want anything to deal with, or to do with that. We've got to focus on the systems we already have. And that's okay. I'm okay with that. Um, so they're, they're going to go on us pretty hard here. They have a couple of charge lasers, and honestly, this is actually the situation we want. So we'll wait until they choose to fire. That could be whenever. Might be now. I'm not even going to dodge these ones. Maybe we'll miss one. Nope. And then I'm going to wait for their other two to fire. We're going to turn off our Ion Blast auto fire. No, we're not. We're going to fire it once. Now we're going to turn it off. They're going to shoot at us, then we'll cloak. And that should give us a, a very high dodge chance. Good enough. Um, and then we're just going to wait for a second. And as our cloak comes off, Ion Blast comes back out. Big miss. That sucks pretty hard. Uh, the next shot that they land could do some serious damage. Uh, be cool. Be cool. Don't get hit. That's uh, four shots incoming. We can't do anything about it. Land on their weapons, please. Please, 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 please. Okay, they hurt us. We took out their, their big chain laser, though, or charge laser. That's the important part. So they're firing again. We just fired an ion blast, so I'm quickly going to cloak out of the way of their shots. And then we're going to ion blast them on the... Well, it doesn't matter where this one hits. And then we'll hit them there, and we'll get that going there. Oh, those misses! I kind of just want to jump away from this one. But we still could theoretically win it. So I don't want to just run away. Okay, there we go. As long as they only have two lasers firing, we're, we're in the clear. Especially when we have a cloak to back it up as well. So this is an important burst laser. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, that's good stuff right there. Okay, both weapons offline. Everybody hurts sometimes. Kind of want to... I'm going to keep their weapons offline, but I kind of want to kill this guy, too. Well, we should be able to kill this guy, though. There we go. So now their pilot has to leave. They have, like, 0% dodge chance. They have no med bay, which I think is, is really not helping their cause here. This burst laser is going to hurt him pretty good. Yeah, that could have killed one more unit, but so be it. And, I'm, and it's still important to fire at shields, I think, but this is a very scary uh, ship that has ended up not actually being that scary. Not a good enough surrender offer for this late in the game, I would say. I thought about it because there was fuel in it, but our fuel's okay. We got 48 scrap instead. That's uh, much better. So there's our extra third bar of shields. Doesn't give us any extra um, missile defense. But it does give us extra laser defense, which actually ended up being kind of a major plot point of that last fight. Extra levels of cloaking would be nice. We're going to interfere and help the Zoltan ship in the hopes that we get a Zoltan crew member. I don't know the, the payouts of all of the, uh, you know, possible situations that we run into. Really, you're going to fight me in the pilot room? You dicks. Um, but I, I think that uh, it's a fairly realistic assumption to assume that that could actually happen. So we're going to land as many shots as we can on their shields with our ions. And we really want to get these breaching bombs up as soon as possible because uh, midbay is not powered up, huh? Uh, we want to get these breaching bombs up as soon as possible because we are struggling a little bit to get through enemy shields. Here come their lasers, so we're going to quickly uh, stop the auto fire and just get ready for the dodge here. Uh, Mantis is almost dead. You're going to go back to the med bay. And then we're going to send a human and rock man in here to deal with this. Why is our NG so low on health? Holy crap. Oh, that's not our NG. That's okay. 
That's fine. Um, now they left. Okay. Uh, I do want a power of the med bay. That should be pretty obvious at this point. Okay, here we go. Their beam can't do shit to us. That's important. Ion blast. Just land. Oh, we're in an asteroid field too. Almost want to like ugh, it lowers our dodge chance so much. I'm gonna I'm gonna power up our med bay briefly by depowering our shields to level two. Come on, ion blast. Land, land, land. Another one. And an asteroid? Nope, no asteroid. So we're going to go on weapons quickly. Good. Uh, we can't cloak out of these lasers. We almost can. But we can't quite. Alright, so this is good. It's better, I should say. Burst laser can come in and really fuck with this, uh, this mantis in the shield room. I like it. He's dead. Okay. So now their shields are in a really messed up situation, which is great. Because obviously they... Um, Kind of rely on that. Uh, Medbay is powered up, so we should be fine here. That they're gonna get out. Burst laser now. Where do you go? I mean, there's there's already fires everywhere. Let's wait and see. Uh, they're gonna. You're really just gonna go hang out in there? <laughs> well, they're all just like we don't have any place to go. So I'm just waiting to see where to fire the burst laser to do the most damage. That seemed like a good choice. Um, you know what? As long as we keep their oxygen offline, I'm pretty sure this mantis will actually die. It'll take a while to actually vent out. We could just kill them too, though. So maybe we'll do that. Uh, Zoltan crew member? Nope. Just some extra scrap. That's okay, though. Is everyone back where they belong? Seems, uh, nope. You should be back here. And we'll save the layout a little bit. And we can't upgrade our ship because we're in a dangerous situation. That's alright, though. Alright, so we have a Zoltan ship. That sucks. They have bombs, beams, and ions. We can theoretically get around those fairly well. Ion Blast is really good at taking out this shield, just because it, it happens so quickly. Um, it, it fires so quickly, I should say. Burst Laser in one or two rounds should also be able to make it happen. Let's see where this bomb lands. This is what scares me. And they actually used uh, uh, their Ion, so I thought I'd cloak out of it. That caused their bomb to miss, which is fine by me. And only their beam is active, so I don't even mind that this is going to... Um, oh, you know what? We might as well fire Burst Laser. we got to take some time to get through enemy shields anyway. Um, so, I, yeah, I didn't even mind that we were coming out of cloak there. But this is a little bit of a scary position. That beam can't get through our shields, which is important. And they did take out one of our weapons, but we got one last Ion Blast off, which is going to be enough for us to maybe hit their shields quickly. Or hit their weapons quickly. Yep, okay, we took one thing offline. It's not the bomb, which would have been the best thing to take offline. Oh, no, wait, our weapons didn't get hit. Our shields got hit. Sorry, that's that's my mistake. That was dumb. Um, we're going to go on weapons again. These are Zoltan. I really hope that they surrender one of their crew members to me. I, again, I don't know if that can actually happen. Worth a try, though, I think. Uh, why don't you go back to your door room? And here comes the Ion, so we're going to cloak out of that quickly. You know what? It can't do damage to us. We, it's, we're better off cloaking out of the, uh, the, the bomb that they shoot. So we killed another couple of Zoltan there. That took their bomb offline, which is even better. And they're having some real issues in here with the whole fire situation. Where are you going now? Um, I almost think it's best to just murder the pilot. Lower their dodge chance. There was I thought that fire might be able to take out those other Zoltans, but it appears not. That's okay, though. I mean, they're done. Just whether or not they know it yet. Didn't surrender. We could still get a Zoltan, maybe? Nope. I harbor hope in the face of poor odds, I suppose. We should really get more reactor power so we can up our dodge chance a little bit. Okay, this is a nasty NG ship. Uh, I don't think it'll shoot down ion weapons on the way in. Let's see if that's correct. It did not shoot down ion weapons on the way in. So we'll wait for their stunner. Actually, their stunner doesn't worry me. We'll wait for those lasers, and then we can probably dodge the stunner as well. Good. Now, um, fuck the fact that we have no stealth weapons. That's okay. Keep landing that ion blast in there. It fires so quickly. Um, now we can go on their weapons with our burst laser. Basically, I like to wait until they only have one bar of shields to use burst laser, because then uh, all I need to do, e even if I miss once, I can still do damage to the system. That's, you know, doesn't get any more complicated than that. Or it doesn't get any simpler than that. Uh, let's... Send our door NG in to fix the oxygen. That's probably faster than just sending the human, believe it or not. They have a bomb and a stunner. A little risky, uh, but we should be able to do some work on them here. Yeah, there we go. And now they just have a bomb, so we'll wait till they fire it. And then we'll cloak. And that caused it to miss. So we'll be firing the entire time. Getting stealth weapons is obviously something that's on my to-do list, but um, we're probably not going to be able to, at least for a while, so 
Might as well just live with it for now. They have a clone bay. We're not going to kill them all um, prior to the, the ship dying, let's be honest. I hit one of their uh, drones by accident, and that took them out. Well, it, that didn't take them out, but hitting their oxygen finally finished them off. So we had 115 scrap. I'm, I'm content with where we're at right now, but I still desperately want to get those two other aliens. Participate in their study? 25 scrap for free. Not so bad. Looks like we're probably going to leave here without getting a Zoltan. A little annoying. And dock with a refueling platform. Quickly dock and refuel. Oh, lost three fuel and three damage to our hull. So, that's disappointing. We are at 50% hull integrity. That kind of sucks. Let's get our uh, NG ready to come in here and help repair our engines. That fire is spreading like crazy. It's like a, you know, a space fire. Those are the worst kind. There we go, and open all doors. You can now come in here and fix it. What do we want to upgrade? First, we needed two bars of reactor power just so we could uh, keep everything powered up appropriately. Then I think another level of cloaking and another bar of reactor power is fairly smart. We can stay cloaked a little bit longer. Next is weapons. Three bars of shields is adequate for the flagship, I think. Uh, before we go to the next sector, why don't we get everyone healed? Lauren, you can come in here. Medbay needs to get powered up. Um, who else? Emma, you're going to get powered up here. Tomas, you're going to get powered up here. This is the best Kestrel run I've had in some time, I think. That's not to say we're, we're sitting pretty, but I've certainly had worse runs than this. At least we made it to a second part. <laughs> Doesn't always happen. So we have a uh, rebel-controlled sector. That's where we're going to go next. And we're looking for shops, because even if we can't win, we want to be able to buy more crew. Uh, just so we can get that red tail, and then we never have to use the Kestrel again. Combat doesn't get any easier from this point on. Here we go. They're trying to get away. We can dodge their missile. The real question is whether or not we can actually get through their shields. So Ion Blast goes and hits. Ion Blast goes and hits. Their missile comes out, so we cloak. 89% chance panned out for us there. Ion Blast goes and misses. We'll use Burst Laser to see if we can hit their weapons. Probably had a little bit more leeway there, but that's fine. They only have two lasers left. Can't do shit to us. Ion Blast goes and misses. That is, I should print that on a t-shirt. Ion Blast goes and it misses. Ion Blast goes and it misses. We're going to try hitting their weapons again. Really want to get that bomb offline. Keep missiles offline. Stay safe. Ah, there we go. The all-important hit. Now, Burst Laser goes. And it actually lands and we killed one. Oh, fuck. That was really dumb of me. I knew that they were trying to escape. I just tunnel vision and focused on the weapons instead. That was really dumb. All right, so they have a drone, a missile, and a laser. They should not be able to, to do anything to us here. Get the ion blast going first. Got to hit him three times to take out two bars of shields. Fuck the laser. It only shoots once. We only have to dodge the missile. All right, that's a big missile. I'm scared. And it missed. Should up our dodge chance just so we're like above 90. I would feel more comfortable with that. Uh, come on, Ion Blast. You can do this here. And we'll get another Ion Blast to go before we fire the Burst Laser. Hey, good enough. And moment of truth. Good enough. We take, we take out their uh, missile launcher. They're going to get back at us pretty darn quickly here. Because they have a system repair drone. Someone just leveled up in something. Oh, shit. Fire the... Fucking eye on you, Dingleberry. There we go. Now, three shots on their weapons. It only takes one shot being successful to actually take out their um, their missile launcher. And we don't actually have to keep their missile launcher offline because uh, we can cloak. So if, if things go terribly wrong, we should still be able to, to be fine. But um, it's important to be safe here. As safe as we possibly can. More ion blast landing. No? Okay. That's fine, too. Uh, they have two bars of shields. Kind of scary. We'll just wait for them to get down to one bar of shields. I think it's worth the wait. Not in that situation, though. There we go. One bar of shields means we fire burst laser if it fucks up. It landed enough, but we're going to have to cloak out of their next missile. I think. Good. Keep hitting. One more shot. Good. That missed. That's bad. Turn off the auto fire. They fire a missile. We cloak. 95% chance is good. So our engine person must have leveled up. Now, we're going to fire as many Ion Blasts as we can while still under the power of uh, cloaking. One more hit. You can do it. Good. Now we go on weapons again with the Burst Laser. Okay, that takes the Missile Launcher offline. The System Repair Drone is fucking up the Equilibrium here. And that's fine. Good for them. 
but also bad for me. There we go, a fire. That's gonna give them a little bit more uh, shit to deal with, a little bit more time that they have to waste. And Burst Laser comes in on weapons again. I really can't believe that, that system repair drone is still online. But it's all right. We need to come up with a better way of actually killing these enemies, because this is reliable, but annoying. And uh, that's pretty much me in a nutshell if you look at my upload schedule. It doesn't really matter where we hit with our next shot, as long as one out of three shots actually lands. Bingo bango. Um, 39 scrap. It's something. It's something. We can... The pursuit was only doubled for one jump, so we're fine. It's an unmanned scout. Ion blast on the weapons, and they can't actually do anything to me, so so we're fine. Even especially if their ion misses, then we're really fine. Uh, we can even cloak out of the way of that one. There you go, and keep going on their weapons here. Might as well auto fire. We're not going to miss any more shots anymore, so might as well take out their weapons. I'm leaning back. I'm having a little bit of water. This is a, a very safe and kind of rote encounter at this point. So weapon power goes up next. We need to get that breaching bomb active. Opening a breach and doing damage to a system is the easiest way to ensure that that system gets totally fucked. We could use that on, say, the uh, three missile launcher on the uh, rebel flagship. That's my thinking right now. 55 scrap. Pretty nice. There is a store, and that is the one reason I have not spent any of the scrap upgrading our weapons already. Because, obviously, yes, weapon pre-igniter is incredible. They're going to try to get away, huh? Weapon pre-igniter is incredible. Stealth weapons would also be very good for us. So we're going to take the ion on the chin, I assume. They're, that, that's firing out of sync. It didn't hit us. So we're waiting for bomb and the two missiles, which uh, we should dodge effectively. Good, we had like a 96% chance. So we have to stop them from getting away. That's not going to be easy. We're going to try to hit their piloting system quickly at the potential cost of uh, taking damage soon because they're going to have a missile launcher, a bomb, lasers, and ions active in a second. We can just get a burst laser on their weapons next. Bomb missed. Thank fucking God. Oh no, never mind. That bomb totally hit our oxygen, didn't it? All right, doorman. Go fix up our oxygen here. That is not a concern at all except for hull damage. So that's probably something we'll get taken care of at the store as well. We can cloak in a second. Uh, good, good. Weapons, weapons hurting pretty bad. We will only cloak when we need to. Keep those shields offline. Um... Ion Blast doing a good job. Almost feel like we should hit their shields, but I think it's better to do this. Oh, they did fire a bomb. It went off in an empty room. Good, that fire is going to go out, but they only have an Ion weapon now, so totally fine. Everyone get back to base. A little scary. Ship's not in a great position. They've cloaked. They're still trying to get away, but they have no piloting system, so whatever. They're not going to fire their Ion weapon, which seems crazy to me. What are they waiting for? Other weapons to be active? You got nobody fixing your shit, man. And this should do it. Oh, they're waiting for shields to come back. That's actually pretty smart. My mistake. Really don't want to talk about that. At least we can still get to that store. That would have been devastating if we couldn't. Alright. Uh, no... Oh, do we... We already have all these races, unfortunately. Um, no need to do that, so we'll buy fuel, and we'll fix up, and that costs a lot. We can't get any weapon power now. That's okay, though, because we're safe. We're safe again. And we've got fuel, which is also important. Asteroid field, a little scary. They're going to cloak and probably try to get away. Uh, maybe they're not trying to get away. Normally it says, like, enemy FTL charging. I've let way too many uh, ships escape for me on this run. This is the best cloak of all time incoming, though. Yeah, fire all your shit at once, please. Here we go. Oh, thank you very much for that. I, would, I had a brief moment of, like, being totally afraid. Because I thought that their uh, missile was actually still going to hit. Because the mist didn't show up until way later than expected. Hit, hit, hit. Okay, good. Now we can actually go on the weapons. Good shit. Okay. Now, still scared about that missile. Laser's meaningless. Although it allows an asteroid an opening. Uh, 35% chance to dodge. Let's hope the odds are on my side. Nope, hit our piloting system. That's gonna really fuck us up for this missile in the future. But we can cloak. So, we'll wait for that next, uh, bout of, uh, fire from them. Should be pretty darn soon. Here's what I'm thinking. 
we quickly fired an ion blast, I think. Now we'll turn the ion uh, blast auto fire off. 95% dodge chance. Very nice. Okay, now we have to ion blast them. We still have to get up in their shit. Couple more hits. Couple more hits. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Oh, the asteroid! Okay, well, we've got a chance here because they got hit by a, an asteroid. Good. They still have their missile launcher up, but at least we've taken out something else. Now, if we can just keep their shields down oh, long enough for a fucking uh, asteroid to hit them. They missed us. That's 35% chance working out in our favor there. I like that. They're going to get another missile charged up. We're going to dodge it, then butt fuck them. I believe in a thing called love. They're going to fire. We fired too. Then we quickly managed to cloak so we won't get hit. Good shit. Go to town on them here with the ion. Come on, asteroids. Asteroids, I need you now to actually get hits. Come on. Oh, ions should be coming in. That was my mistake there. There we go. Asteroid. 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 Oh my god. Ah. Ah. There's no point in even using a... There is a point in using a breaching bomb. Where did, we get, where did we get hit? Did we get hit? No, okay, that's fine. We're getting hurt here. That's the problem. Theoretically, this shouldn't be as difficult as it is, but it is as difficult as it is. Maybe it's prudent for us to just jump away. I really am not encouraged by that result. So be it. We're gonna repair 10 damage for 20 scrap. Smart play in my mind. Uh, disappointing. Anyway, we gotta get this, we gotta get breaching bombs up. That'll be a counterbalance in our favor. Buy some fuel. I will buy three fuel for six scrap. Decent trade. All right, next sector, sector seven, NG controlled. Please tell me you control some Zoltans and Slugs. Zold, Slugs, and Harmony, my favorite uh, rap group, rap empresarios of the 90s. Uh, pay their toll. That's not gonna happen. I'm thinking. I don't know why I see. I sounded like a kid who was really glad that he pooped or something. Mommy, I pooped. I'm thinking. Nothing to be proud of there. But, they don't have cloaking. Cloaking is where we get kind of fucked up here. If we have cloaking, they don't have cloaking, that's great. We just need to dodge their missile. And that's, that's easy. Uh, we'll see if we can even sneak in a shot prior to this. Good. They're gonna fire their missile. Sucks to be you. Good miss, and then... No need to fire the ion blast yet. We'll fire it now that the burst laser is going to be active, and we'll go quickly on their uh, weapons area. Two hits is enough. Uh, you know what? We're going to try to land this ion on their weapon area quickly. Good. Take their missile offline. That's how we micro that ion effectively. Now, they are going to be able to sneak in uh, a little bit of repair here and uh, a little bit more shield charge. But as long as I just can cloak my way out of their next missile attack, that's the only thing that matters. Don't miss so much. Stop missing. That's a pretty integral part of my whole strategy here. Sure, fire two missiles in my shields. Big fucking whoop. Keep it up. As long as that missile's offline, I don't give a shit. Keep it up. Keep it up. Missile's online. Here comes the burst laser. Good enough. Took it offline. This is all we need to keep doing here. The cloak is meaningless. For now. Good. Hit him where it hurts. And that's the shit right there. I'm getting very, very violent in my, my play right now, but... I hope you understand why it's it's getting intense here. I'm gonna hit their piloting system. Not a good enough surrender offer. Piloting system in the red means we don't miss anymore. And it means they gotta repair something else as opposed to just going after the weapons. Almost wanna hit them where it hurts in the oxygen next, but we'll, we'll start with the uh, weapons still. There we go. Everything's offline. Life sucks. Well, we're going to go on the uh, oxygen system, because even if we hit only once, that's all that matters, because that's going to fuck with them. All right, so annoying, but we got through it. 66 scrap, nothing to sneeze at either. Is there a store here? Is that why I'm not buying anything? There is. Okay, good. The stealth weapon's still important. Pre-igniter, obviously extremely important. Okay, so, I mean, we have a little bit of an advantage here, because they have, um... They have a Zoltan shield, but they also have, uh, an asteroid field. Mind you, they have the Zoltan shield plus three bars of shields, whereas we only have three bars of shields. But we can cloak our way out of their shots. So they fired at us once. Um, stop firing burst laser. Stop auto firing at least. Three shots. Doesn't scare me. This scares me. So we cloak. Stop auto firing ion blast. Good miss. Now ion blast comes back in. Hit him where it hurts. Keep it up. Hit him a couple more times. Hit him a couple more times. There we go. That's good enough. The asteroid did a ion blast job for us. We did take out their piloting system, but unfortunately, they are going to get another missile shot in here. Keep those shields out. Yeah, asteroid, do 
the Lord's work, my son. Now, uh, they're gonna surrender. We're not gonna accept it, because the most dangerous thing they have is that missile that actually just missed us right there, so... Awesome. If we can keep their shields offline, they're fucked. Three lasers? That's cute. Alright, so now, um... Gonna go to town on this weapons bay. Fuck that NG to death. Mmm... Yeah. Now it doesn't really matter what we do. As long as, you know, a couple asteroids get in there, and they did, or our lasers get in there, and they did, we're fine. 50 scrap, pretty good payout. This is an important store. More crew members, please. You got, you got humans. What am I supposed to do with humans, man? Okay. What's been our problem so far? Shields. We gotta wait forever to get the, uh, the ion blast actually working. Or sorry, we gotta wait forever for the ion blast to actually get through shields. Flak cannon charges in 10 seconds and would take out shields very easily, allowing us to then use a uh, burst laser to, to hit him where it hurts, right? But is the breaching bomb better? It requires two power. You know what? We can mix it up between them if we wanted to. How long does the breaching bomb take to charge? And do we have any, we have nothing to sell? That's kind of rare, honestly. Um, what do they have on page one? Drone control, not a defense drone. We already have our defense from missiles in the form of our, uh, in the form of our uh, cloaking. How long does the breaching bomb take to charge? 17 seconds. It's a weird one. Can we get both? We need four extra weapon power. Nope, we can only get three. We could get both if we didn't use something else. Can you tell I'm a little torn here? I feel a little torn. I think we're okay with what we have. Flat cannon tears up shields so well though, but breaching bomb would be a nightmare if we dropped it on like enemy shields. Uh, ha, ha, ha. I would love to use both. What else do they have for sale? They have uh, Burst Laser Mark II. It's really good. Is it better to have two of those active than like one and then a Breaching Bomb? That'll give us six shots. It requires the same amount of power. What if I use that instead of that? That requires one bomb. Okay. Um, what we could theoretically do. Because the Ion Bomb only requires one damage. We could sell Breaching Bomb, buy either Flat Cannon or Burst Laser. Kind of prefer Burst Laser, because it, it does the same amount of shots. These are more targetable, though. Um, okay, okay. This might be a terrible idea. We sell Breaching Bomb. We buy Ion Bomb and Burst Laser couple fuel. Why? Uh, once we get more scrap, we can power up all of these weapons simultaneously. I gave them the fuel, they gave me some sector scans. A little scary, I hope I can just make it to the exit here. It's the most important thing. So actually I'm thinking, um, at this point it's actually probably better to have um, burst laser active, like two burst lasers. I think beats the Ion Blast in this situation. They got one hell of a drone here. Uh, they're just gonna fire at me like this though, that's fine by me. We'll cloak when they fire uh, a lot of shots at once. Like, right now for example. This could be a terrible decision, don't get me wrong. Could be a terrible decision. We're gonna fire everything we've got at weapons. This is gonna be six shots. Good enough, took one of their weapons offline. We can still take damage from them. It's unlikely now though. Um, especially with our dodge chance being decent. Uh, we're gonna do exactly the same thing. Good. Good shit. Keep him, keep him busy. And, uh, our cloak's gonna be back. Not in time. We weren't able to do damage, though. And, you know what? We're gonna maybe hit him where it hurts. This is... Is this sustainable? I have no idea. Uh, seems to be working out alright, though. Alright, they fired at us, so I'm gonna cloak. Good enough. Um, maybe we hit... No, we still gotta hit weapons, man. Yeah, we gotta take out one of their weapons, otherwise we're in danger here. Now, this is not gonna be the fastest way of taking out enemy ships. But it might be a way of taking out enemy ships. That is maybe... And, I mean, this is not the fully realized version of the plan. Don't judge me yet. Ooh, that was scary. Good, you came back. They're firing. We can't cloak. This is scary. Oh, we took some shots. Okay, oxygen's gotta get fixed up. Get over there and fix that shit ASAP. And... What the fuck, man? 
Maybe we just jump away? We can get to that store, buy some more fuel. I need to get all of my, my parts working together here. Thank you for the fuel. I need to, I need to get the, the weapons up, up. I need to get the ion bomb active at the same time. I need to get ion blast active at the same time. Oh, I'm an idiot too, aren't I? I can't get everything active here, but I can micro it. Even just having the ion blast active would be good. I'm, I maybe have made a grave mistake here. Tomas, why don't you heal yourself up in the med bay briefly? This is a wild one. I'm glad to still be alive. I've given up hope, unfortunately, of uh, actually managing to, you know, get to the next uh, layout here because they just didn't really give me the option to get more alien races. It's alien races, not alien racists. That's totally different. Probably. I wouldn't know. And we are going to go to this quest beacon because it's on the way. Probably just get some more scrap for free. Wow, okay. That's actually how that shit worked out. So we'll jump to our store quickly. Can't really afford to spend any more scrap on upgrades. If there's two alien slaves in there, I will buy them. There's a Zoltan. I have to buy him. I have to, just in case we have a chance. I think I can honestly sell the Ion Bomb. I know I just bought it and I'm going to lose scrap on the transaction, but I can't keep all this shit active at once. It does one Ion damage. <sighs> Maybe it's better to use the Ion Bomb because it can get through drones easier. And then... That takes fucking forever to charge. We're going to sell it. That was a dumb purchase. I'm an idiot. All right, so we bought our Zoltan. That's also like buying a bar of reactor power, so don't judge me. Zoltan's going to go in the weapons room because he's going to give the weapon room more power. By giving the weapon room more power, we can start to get close to having this ion blast on. We need one more bar of weapon power. Hopefully we get it from this quest. I didn't buy any fuel. Ah, oh, I'm, I'm a dumb idiot all the time. Upgraded reactor by one. That's that's meaningless. Okay, that'll take one fuel. So I'll have two fuel left. I'll have one fuel left. I'll have zero fuel left. I've got to try to get to the exit at least. And then we need like 100 scrap to get this next weapon up. Respond to the call, move in, and assist. Intruders on board. That's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm running uh, pretty close. Oh, good. Our door system broke. Well, that means our mantises have to get in here. ASAP, get this sorted out. They have lasers and drones? That's not so bad. Lasers and drones. Lasers and drones. We're gonna cloak. Quickly. Three bars of shields is basically the same shit we've been dealing with for a while here. Good miss. Yeah, that was, wasn't important that we hit that anyway, so. Um, now, our mantises are not in a good place. Get that powered up ever so slightly. Uh, and you gotta come in here and fight a little bit. Can't really afford to let them take out our oxygen system. Why are you not getting in there and helping? And this laser's gonna hurt. Theoretically. You gotta go, man. Get get in there. Um, did we lose a crew member? We may have... Oh, they made it! I don't know why they got stuck there. Oh, maybe the door system got hacked. Um, Alright, mantises. We're gonna have to get in there and fix our oxygen. Oh, shit. Burst laser's ready to go, though. Um, let's launch those quickly before we cloak. <laughs> Three shots can't do shit to us. That is a little more scary. These mantises are going to fix up the oxygen just fine. We need... We're one... Oh my god, you didn't fix it in time. You motherfuckers. I hate you. Um, oh, shit. Well, I hope we can get that repaired in time. We're, we're literally like one weapon shy of being able to win. Two lasers means nothing. There we go, we're fine. Yeah, we're two weapons shy of being able to win. Which is fine, I mean... Or being able to win against any ship. Against the flagship, I have no goddamn idea. Can we cloak? No, nope, this is gonna hurt. Unless we took one of the weapons offline. We might have, just in time. We should maybe go on shields, I guess? Like... This is why we need that ion damage up as soon as possible. If we win this, we'll probably get the scrap necessary. That can't do anything to us. I have no idea. I have no idea how we're going to do on this one. This has been a crazy long video. We're still alive. Their shots uh, are a little scary. Might as well cloak out of them. Just so they can't do anything. Maybe it makes more sense to burst laser on shields right away. We're so offensively impotent for all the money that I've spent on offense that it's kind of amazing to me. Now they have nothing that they can offer in defense. 
or in offense, I should say. Their defense is still all right, but there we oh, we killed them. Okay, I didn't think it could possibly happen, but it did. 52 scrap. Need to get a little bit higher. Maybe we'll get some combat here. Doubt it. Attack the rebels. We will, because we need we need scrap. Um, we can cloak, and that'll fuck with their hacking. We're gonna hack our oxygen system, huh? And they're gonna board us. So we're gonna cloak quickly, and that will cause their boarding drone to explode, I think. But we're still gonna be weak to missiles and lasers now. So we just wait it out. Just wait it out. Nope. Still gonna have to fight. Okay, well, Mantises, you're gonna get in here ASAP. Um, we're gonna go on their shield bay as quickly as possible. Ugh. Oh, oh. Why are you breaking my balls with my own balls? You bre you're a ball breaker. I don't like when you hack my oxygen like that, video games. Gotta get these shields out of the way. We learned that the last time. Get that fucking breach repaired, yo. Get that freak- Oh, they did it. Okay. Get in the med bay and never speak of this day again. They fired on us. We're gonna cloak. Oh, we didn't cloak in time. I'm a dumb idiot who is an animal and doesn't deserve anything good in this world. Oh, good. Hurt their shields a little bit. Good enough. Get in here. Take out the fire, man. Don't you carry fire extinguishers? I've, I've experienced a fire before in my life. I was able to put out the fire faster than you, and you're like a trained crew here. Good. Weapons are down. Oxygen is... Oh, totally fucked. Um, okay. Mantis. Fuck the med bay. Everyone fuck the med bay. Get in here. Fight. For your right, is that an NG? Where's our NG at, man? Oh, he's in here. Fight for your right to get into this fucking oxygen room. Once you break down that door, we're gonna have um, we're gonna have the NG come in there and repair. This is messed up. Are our sensors down? What's okay? Human, you stay. You. Oh man. Oh Jesus Christ. What a clusterfuck. Who's who's almost dead? You're almost dead. No, yeah, you're the you're the chosen one. Now you leave. We'll we'll deal with that breach later. Okay, they fired at us. That's a good time to cloak. Oh, thank Christ, that worked out. We only had an 85% chance to dodge. Oxygen's in a bad spot. It's gonna go down, down, down here. There we go. Burst laser the shit out of their shields. Oh, we killed a man. Okay. This is a nightmare. We have no chance against the flagship. All we need is one more alien, though. Don't hit. Oh, that hit pretty nicely, didn't it? Our Zoltan crew member is, um, last man standing right now. Um, if he dies, we don't stand a very good chance anymore. Oh, that missile fired too quickly. Uh, we don't stand a very good chance anymore of, uh, being able to get that, uh, final layout, do we? Now, we actually do have a cloak up now, much to my surprise. So we're gonna use that right away. Thank God that missed. I still think we can make this work. It's not going to be easy. All... Oh, three of the shots missed there. Are you kidding me? Missile's about to be charged. That's a dangerous position. Oxygen just got hacked. Don't fuck with me, game. Go! Yes! Okay. We have survived. Steal the civilian supplies. Oh. Didn't give us anything. Okie dokie. Uh, who has health? Banks, you have health. You're coming in here to fix this up. Rockman, you have health. You're coming in here to fix this up. Bomfy, you're the man I'm looking for here. Oh shit, we made it work. Okay. Now, you guys are just gonna leave this room. And can you believe that we did not lose a single crew member in that whole ordeal? I can't. I, I just genuinely cannot. I think that we should probably have lost right there. But truth be told, we didn't even take that much hull damage. We took a little bit, but we're going to get repaired as soon as we go to the next sector anyway. And all we need, 90? 90 is enough. We can get our Ion Blast working again, use it in conjunction with Cloak, hope that this makes all the difference. Can you feel the, the passion in my voice right now? It's got to happen. Jump to the next sector. The last stand. At least we made it. At the very least, we made it. Now, we could cheese the game a little bit if the 
Thank you for that 10 hull points in the fuel. Uh, if the fight against the Rebel flagship takes place in range of a repair beacon, we could get down to one health, jump away, repair back to full or close to full. We'll see how this works. Um, their drones don't scare me until their weapons fire. So here we go. We just ion blast. If we can take out a couple of bars of shields, that's really all that matters. I'm still not scared about this, actually. One of those might miss, and it did. So we don't need to waste our cloak. And I don't, I'm don't. i worried about wasting cloak, because I want to... Um, uh, it's good enough. We're fine. Um, we're still going to be fine. I want to make sure that I don't uh, waste cloak, because we need to do this ion damage in a timely fashion, you know? So, seems smart to me. There we go. The ion is tipping things very much in our favor. This is a fairly easy ship as well. That might be part of it. Make sure these burst lasers land. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, and then this should finish them off then, more or less. No need to use our cloak if it's not necessary. Starting to believe again. I believe in a thing called luck. Just listen to the rhythm of my heart. There's a chance we can make it now. We'll be rocking till the sun. Well, I mean, the sun doesn't really go down in space, but we'll be rocking all the time. Maybe is a better way to put that. Okay, so what are we doing down here? We're coming down here so that we're in range of a repair beacon when we fight the flagship. You can do it. All right. Drones don't scare me. Actually, they have a... Yes, they have... Oh, oh, oh an ion intruder drone and a boarding drone. That scares me. So what do we do? We fire the shit out of these ion blasts. God damn it. Uh, we quickly see if we can take out their drone control unit. Oh, good enough to take one of them out. Um, so Mantis 1, you come here. Mantis, oh, this Ion Intruder drone is the fucking worst, man. Get ready for my fucking nightmare. Yep, there they go, disabling basically all my shit. Uh, we gotta hit that drone control unit again where it hurts. We hit, we hit something. The Ion Intruder drone is stuck. Get that repaired, man. Mantis, you come back in here and fight this guy. Get this done. Get, oh, uh, that's gonna hurt unless we cloak. Which we will. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, the Ion Intruder Drone's still alive! What are you doing, buddy? Get two Mantises to fight him or something. Oh, who's hurting? You're hurting. Get in the med bay. We'll send, uh... Send our NG to man this room for now. You can do it. You can do it. Da! Yes! Okay. Burst laser's active. Get powered up, motherfucker. Keep that drone control unit eating shit and dying forever. Good. Oh, here's a boarding drone. We can't cloak. Landing in Rockman territory. See if you can land one. Nope. Didn't expect so. All right. Uh, power up the shit out of this med bay. You all need to get in here as soon as possible. Oh, here come some shots, and they got a lot of drones active again. Get going. Get going. Get going. Oh, there's an Ion Intruder drone. Shot landed. And shots fired. Here we go. Get that cloak ready, but not active yet. Burst laser the shit out of their drones. Good shit. Okay. Boarding drone is, is dead. Ion Intruder drone still a pain in the ass. Oh, did they board us in here too? Okay, you gotta get out then, man. I don't care if that lowers our dodge chance to zero. Keep it going. Keep it going. Ion Blast doing good shit here. Burst lasers. Oh, that's it right there. Pilot man, you gotta escape from this room. We'll, we'll deal with this later. You guys get out. Get um, get some other people involved in this med bay situation. Good shit, Ion Blast. You've done your part. I'm sorry, I'm silent for a second. It just felt good to not have to deal with this anymore. Alright, so now they're all gone. Tomas, you gotta get in the med bay, buddy. How do we do this? You three, I would say you come repair this. Oh, only two can repair it, and you two. I uh, mean, you and you come repair this. Truth be told, that actually turned out totally fine. Just close the breach. That's the only thing that matters. It's like Pacific Rim up in here. Get that shit settled. Okay, good, good, good. Good, good, good. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> With 111 scrap, the next thing we do is get the next level of cloaking. We have so little reactor power. Typically by this point, I'll have like uh, 
not 100% reactor power, but I'll be at like at least 75. This is maybe the most I've, the furthest I've gotten with the least in this game. I would not hesitate to say that. So everybody's basically healed up here. Banks, you're, you're fine. Where are you anyway? 98, that's okay. That's as many degrees as there were in 98 degrees, so I'm entitled to think that that's alright, I think. So, third level cloaking, power that shit up. Might as well get one more bar of reactor power. Get, keep that med bay active, that might end up being pretty important. You're n not in the weapons room, I'm an idiot. Disregard that, though. Um, here we go, we wait. And then the rebel ship will come to us. Why are we waiting here? Because, again, if we get down to one health and we know we're gonna die, at least we can jump to that repair beacon, right? Alright, here comes the hack. This is an important moment. Hacked our engines. That's pretty bad, but we can still cloak out of the way of some shit. Now, how the fuck is this fight gonna work? We ion blast the shit out of their shields. No, there's no other way around it. Here we go. Three shots. Don't care. Three missiles. Care a lot. Turn off auto blast on the ions for a second. Good shit. Okay, come back. Ion blast. Two bars of shields. I like that. I like that enough to fire some burst lasers at their missiles. Good. Take take him out for now. Keep the ion blast going here. Th these ions are gonna hurt. Two of them missed. That's the greatest luck I've ever had in my entire existence as a human being. Good shit. I apologize for my profanity. This is an intense run though. Zero percent dodge chance here is obviously horrible. Um. There's no other way to, there's no two bones about that, are there? Now, hit him, good. That beam does nothing. Wait for their missiles, hit him, good shit. Ion's coming, scary. They all hit. Next time they fire, which they just did, we cloak. Goodbye, ion blast goes. Hit him again, hit him again with the ion. One bar of shields, that's the magic number. Fuck your missiles forever. Yes, okay. As long as the missiles are taken out, they're not gonna come back online now in this fight. Good tactics, play smart, one weapon at a time. It's a repeatable strategy. This is gonna hurt. No, it's not, okay, fine. We could maybe cloak out of these ions, not quite in time. That's fine, we can cloak in a second. Next time they fire something, we'll cloak. Keep hitting them where it hurts. Two bars of shields. One bar of shields, we can wait for it. One more. That's gonna hurt, we're gonna cloak. Oh, there's one bar of shields. They, we might be okay, though. They're gonna hack our engines. Terrible time to do it, because they're not even gonna fire. Come on, no bars of shields come back. No bars of shields come back. Here we go. Um, now, fuck your ions. Good, take that out. One more volley will make that a, a possibility. They're not a threat to us anymore. Hit them where it hurts. Three bars of shields. We'll wait for two bars of shields this time. Still fine. We'll wait for one bar of shields this time. No, we won't. Come on, you can... We hit them once! Oh my god! That was unexpected. Now again, we have to use cloaking a little bit less religiously now because we're taking out their weapons one by one. This is not gonna be the fastest run of FTL of all time. That's okay, though. Three bars of shields. Boom. Wait for two bars. Oh, it's gonna be tough. That beam does nothing. Well, you know, we could theoretically sneak a shot in here. Let's try it out. We hit them. Um, that's going to cause a fire that might burn them to death. Oh, I think we got him. I think we got him. And if we got him, that fire is going to keep raging. And this is a very, you know, slow and steady wins the race, right? It's a very slow way of doing things. There's a cloak for us there. Good. That weapon's completely taken out. They still have lasers and beam. Lasers and beam can hurt us. But maybe it's time to start focusing on shields instead. Just hit him. Three bars of shields. That missed. We're gonna try on three bars of shields. Maybe take out their laser. One hit's good enough to wound him for now. Keep it going. Remember that if they have no weapons, it's open season. Two bars of shields. Oh, missed. That's fine, we'll wait. Hacked our engines, no big deal. I'm starting to believe. I don't know how we get out of this when it comes to dealing with the drones. Ooh, that's, that's the first damage we've taken in a while, though. That's okay. Here we go, Ion Blast. Did the trick, three bars. Ion Blast. Two and a half bars, rounds up. Two bars, that is our cue to go for the laser. No need. Oh, come on, fire. This fire is out of control, it's gonna burn this city. 
Burn the city. Okay, we will see. When he comes back, we'll see if he's still alive. If he's not, they only have a beam, and we've won. I mean, we've already won this, this first phase, which I didn't think was going to be possible. He's still alive. That sucks. Come on, Ion Blast. You can do it. Only got to hit once more. Let's give it a try. Ooh, no, we got to hit it twice more. But now we only have to hit their ship once more, so I think we're going to be fine here. They can't fire their laser at us, so they actually just can't do damage, so this should do it. Good first fight. Good, very good first fight. To 20 scrap. Wonderful. So we're going to follow them because we can still do the trick where we go to the repair beacon just as we're about to die. And at least maybe get that next level layout. They got a lot of drones. What do we do? We cloak right as the power surge happens. And we got we want to cloak our way out of their missiles as well. I'm not sure which is more important. We're going to have to judge it on a case-by-case -case basis. All right. Medbay Mantis. Great name for a feature-length movie. Also exactly the situation we're dealing with right here. Two bars. Two bars. That is go time on missiles. Open a breach. Start a fire. Missiles are out. They're never going to come back. Now we only have to worry about cloaking to stop their drones. Get ready. Here comes the, the power. Who's almost dead? Mantis and Rockman. Mantis, get out of there. Engie, come help. Here, there's the drones. We cloak. And we can turn off Ion Blast for a second. Cloak? They're going to be gone in a second. Good, good enough, good enough. There they go. Goodbye. Okay. Ion Blast, you go again. They've only got one bar of shields up. Fantastic. Um, I say we take out uh, lasers now. We know the defense against drones now. That's the only thing that matters there. Their shields are completely out. Okay, now the, they want to fight us in here. We got two mantises that... Uh, we got two mantises with your name on it. We're not going to be able to cloak out of this one. That sucks. But we can fire quickly. Let's hit their drone control unit. Take it out. Good. We should be in less danger now, although still a little scary. Good enough. Good enough. Okay. NG, get back in here, dog. Help me fix up this breach. Oh, that hurts. Hurts a little. Doesn't hurt a lot. Okay. What do we what do we hit them with next? Why don't we uh one here and then one on the beam? Good. Just wanted to kill that guy. Now they have no weapons except drones. Angie's almost dead. You gotta get out of there, dog. Alright, you guys are all you're all fixed up now. We Medbay's going fine. We're gonna be able to cloak out of this next um out of this next problem. We should fire our beams first though. What do we fire on? Let's hit him where it hurts with respect to this crew. Good. Okay. We cloak. And don't auto-fire. Oop, we auto-fired. <laughs> this is going very well. They've only got one uh, one health left. And there we go. And on this most unlikely of Kestrel runs. We're going that way, huh? We hope we can hit two repair beacons here, so I suggest we do so. <sighs> on this most unlikely of Kestrel runs, we are doing very well. Third phase has a Zoltan energy shield, a really nasty um, auto attack, and we can't kill all the crew. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Do we actually have a chance here? I'm feeling a little cheeky about it, but I think we might have a shot. Um, and you know what? I'm going to toot my own horn. I think we've played pretty well, too. I think there's been some bad decisions, but I, uh, I'm stoked as well to have one final chance here to make this work. We're gonna hit up our repair beacon. Full he fully healed. Feels good. Um, where are they going next? This is what I want to know. Uh, they're going to the base next, so we should go back to the base and wait. The reason I think this is because we can still do the repair beacon trick on the other side. So, we'll jump and wait. This is exciting. Mind control. Forgot about that. They mind controlled our mantis in the shield room. Cloaking's not gonna do anything for us. You know what we do? We we fire like crazy on their uh, energy shield to start with. Oh, they boarded us as well. Uh, that's not as bad. And who, they took over the Mantis. Why don't we send the Rockman in there? Rockman will like be a little bit more of a, oh my God, you got hurt pretty badly. Rockman will be a little bit better of a target because they have more HP. And we can just kind of alternate people in and out of our situation here. Like, we can send Rockman in here and then send another Mantis in this way. Ideally, our person won't die. They fired three missiles. I'm going to fire all my shit at first. And then we cloak. The energy shield's not completely out yet. How did you get through there? 
I'm actually just kind of impressed. Now, uh, our Mantis is almost dead. So we'll, um, you're gonna do it this way now? Huh? So you're entitled to make your own mistakes in life. Um, you wanna take out my sensor room? Are we fine here? Just give it a second. Good, we, ki we killed one intruder. Close this door if possible. Well, we can't, okay. Um, well, if you want to fight us in the medbay, that's like the ideal scenario for me. Now there's a power surge detected. This is what scares me a little bit. We can't cloak though, so we might as well just fucking ion blast. Good, good, oh, that's the scary shit. Okay, fire quickly on missiles so they can't get another one off, maybe. Oh man, okay, that's, that's a nightmare. Who's hurt? Mantis is in a bad place. You guys have got to come help fight the human here. Got to get that ion blast back online too. Put that fire out, Rockman. You know your job. Okay, their missiles are offline. They did fire off some more shots, which is going to be frightening. We still have three bars of shields. This is good. This is good. This is fine. Uh, NG, fuck the doors, man. Go replace this. Um, and now that you're safe, get in here quickly. Repair that cloaking bay. Ion blast is good to go. Okay. Burst laser. I don't think it's the best time to use it. Human got taken control of. Um, Rockman. Take your time, Rockman. No no rush, right? Now, no need to cloak yet. They have three bars of shields. Let's see if we can hit their lasers. Nope. Now, here comes the power surge. That's a cloak. Good, good, good. Okay. Rockman's still alive. We're going to send Mantis in here to fight this human just so he doesn't manage to kill anything. This is risky, but we're making progress right now. Who's almost dead? Mantis, you freaking suck, dog. You're terrible. We might actually end up having to kill our human crew member to keep him from killing our weapons. Now, I don't like the, that idea any more than you do. Good hit. We'll try it at least. Ooh, okay, we wounded them. Our, <laughs> now it's like, well, your human's almost dead. I think at this point, if we just leave and then maybe send somebody back, here comes the, here comes the dangerous part. Just auto fire this. This is scary. Yep, okay, things got hurt. Our human's still alive. This human get back in the engine room. Uh, NG, you gotta fix up shields. ASAP. Same to you, Rockman. But we're still in an okay position here, I think. That's good. One more hit, maybe? One more hit. We can wait. Three, three lasers does nothing to us. Okay, now two, we take out this weapon. Yes! Okay, all their weapons are offline. Everybody get back to your rooms of choice, except for Banks and you, which means we need someone there and maybe like that. Oh, just in time. Okay. Now, keep us going. Nobody's gonna die here for a second. We've got nobody in the engine room. That has to change. Um, okay, Banks, you're getting back on health here. That's okay. Get ready. Someone's almost dead. Zoltan, run, man. Um, burst laser goes on the mind control unit. ASAP, take that shit offline. Good, good, good. There's their energy shield back. They didn't do a power surge? Lauren, where are you at? You need health, man. Get in there. I think we're going to win the game. I think we're going to win on normal. And I, I don't know if I deserve it. But I do know that we're, we're going to do it. Oh, they're going to have a chance to get all their bars of shields back up. Oh, they are. Not happy, but nothing's gonna get repaired because the ship's so isolated. Um, well, I don't, you know, if the Zoltan's just gonna be like that, fine, whatever. Attack our med bay. That's the best place for you to be. We cloak out of that, 90% chance. Good, 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 good. Okay, keep on the shields there, buddy. Two more hits. Two more hits. One more hit. One more hit. Good. Don't really care about killing the crew member. Just wanted to keep that mind control unit offline. Power surge detected again? Are you kidding me? It's been like two seconds. We could kill them here, though. Fire fast. Uh, on the med bay. One more hit. We need one more hit to win the game. Oh. I, guys, I think it's going to happen. I think this is finally going to be me beating the game on normal. We did it. We did it with the Kestrel. I did not expect that. <laughs> Especially... After the the run went uh, a little bit tits up for a while, um, I'd like to thank everybody for giving me that positive feedback. Of course, that's not even our best score ever. Excuse me? I, I beat the game on normal, Kate. What? 
You can't even see it because it's not in my high scores for some reason. Um, yeah. It doesn't even show up in high scores, but here, I'll... Do I need to prove it to you? Do it. I'll try. Um, congratulations, you defeated the Rebel flagship and ensured the victory of the Federation. Um, new game. V, new. Uh, achieved with type A on normal. Oh, shit. I finally did it. Thanks for I watching. Did it. If you liked the video, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. I feel good. I'll see you next time. Do it now.